Hello my travelers, welcome back to another vlog on Let's Travel Colombia. Jonathan here as always. And today, don't worry, is the second part of our trip to Victoria Caldas, Colombia. And I can tell you that it was pretty exciting. So before we go with the video, if you're not subscribed, please go ahead and subscribe. Hit the bell icon so you will receive notifications every time we upload a video. Leave us your comments if you like last video and hit the like button because that help us a lot. So without further ado, let's go to the video, my travelers. Good morning, my travelers. It is our second day in Victoria, and we started earlier today because we wanted to do some bird watching. Now, Victoria has one of the most potentials for this activity of Colombia. There are a lot of different birds, and we just wanted to take some cool pictures of some birds and see what we can find in the Hotel Balmoral. And I will show you the pictures or the video that I can catch with the birds. Plus, waking up early is always good because you have the opportunity to see the sunrise. So, as always my travelers, today is going to be a very adventurous day. So, let's go on with it. time of one of the most important meals of the day breakfast and my favorite this is what we're having for breakfast today look at this with a flower and everything looks nice Okay, my travelers, so here we are in the car. We're going to the first river, which is called La Cristalina, and you're gonna see why it's called La Cristalina. Super clear waters and very nice place to visit. We are with Camilo and we are on our way, so I'll see you there. Okay, my travelers, so we continue here in this trip and we arrive to a rubber plantation. All of these trees that you see is where they extract the rubber from. I've never seen this before. You know, like any sort of rubber that you use normally at home uh, or industrial uses, they come from these tall looking trees. Look at that. And this forest looks really nice and it's super big. Like as far as you can see, there are trees where they plant, uh, when they're, where they get this or extract this rubber. And let me just show you how it looks. So here we go. Apparently, so they cut the tree. They make like a line all around it. And then they collect it right here. And that's the rubber that they are collecting. Then it is processed and is used for all different stuff. But it's a pretty interesting thing to see. my travelers so we arrived here to a very special place which is a natural pool and it looks pretty amazing the waters are super clean and crystal clear let me just show you 
the pool that I'm talking about. And plus, we are having a fantastic day. It's super sunny, so it's perfect for this plan. But check this out. So you can jump from this here because it's pretty deep in there. But look at the water. You can see the bottom of the river, which is pretty cool. And that's where we're going. We're going to switch to the GoPro because obviously this cannot get wet. So let's switch to the GoPro now. Okay, my travelers, we changed to the GoPro. How do you see me? Do you hear me well? I hope you do because we are jumping into the pool now. Okay, and it's lunch time and we are having something very traditional. This is our lunch packed in this plantain leaf. So let me just show you it is. Ooh, sausage, has some meat, potato, plantain, egg, rice, everything you need. And with a beer, oh, that's perfect. Okay, my traveler, so after lunch, we're going to go up in the river because there are some things that they wanted to show me over there. So it's not going to be a very easy trek, but they tell me that it's going to be very special. And then we're going to come back here because there is a bridge which, in which supposedly you can jump to the river. I don't know if I'm going to do it. Maybe. We'll see. But let's go up in the river. So we walked, we swam, and we climbed some rocks all the way up in the river for about 50 minutes until we arrived to a very nice place where you can see different waterfalls and some cool places to swim. But the way down was by the river. Let the current take you and it was very fun. Yes, I was told that there were a lot of water activities. And also they told me that there were some places from which you can jump to the river, sort of an adventure thing and I love water don't get me wrong but heights is a different thing that I am a little bit afraid of so on this trip I had to confront many of those fears <laughs> And in case that you were wondering, no, that wasn't me.
I faced my fears little by little throughout this trip until the last opportunity that what was for me the highest that I ever jumped from. And I think I'm gonna leave this video right here. If you wanna see what happened on the rest of the trip and what was the highest point that I jumped from, you will have to stick with us. Remember to subscribe to our YouTube channel, hit the bell icon so you will have notifications every time we upload a video, and hit the like button, of course, to help us with the YouTube algorithm. As well, leave us your comments if you like this video, follow us on our social media, Facebook, Instagram, send us a message if you want to visit Victoria and all of these magical places that I'm showing you so we can arrange your trip. And a special thanks to Save Us Travel and Balmorale Hotel for having us and showing us these spectacular places. As always, thank you very much for watching my travelers and I'll see you on the next one.